is as good as it gets for quarterbacks, man. This is this is all world. You ready? I'm here with uh, one of the best in the business, John Gruden, Super Bowl champion, and uh, now now someday you're going to come back, aren't you? Everybody. Wants to come back. I don't know. Having lost the game in a few years is a good feeling. Yeah. Well, tell me about it. Tell me about um, just what it's been like being on the other end of it. I know you've had a lot of fun with uh, working with quarterbacks and also on Monday Night Football. So tell me about what you like about doing that. Well, I love football. I particularly love the NFL. And being a broadcaster with ESPN on Monday Night Football has given me an opportunity to really stay close to the game. Uh, the quarterback series has been a blast. We just did a show with Brett Favre. I might have to do one with you cool, cool. coming up here soon. But uh, we're just having a lot of fun. Really excited about the start of another season. Tell me about the Hall of Fame, Coach. Obviously, you're out here doing this camp. 600 kids learning the game of football. Let it go. Bust the hit. Oh. Yeah. Learning the game of football, but more importantly, learning the game of life. Tell me about when it started for you. Uh, when you look at these kids, does it remind you about when you were growing up? I grew up in Ohio, right down the road in Dayton. And my dad was a coach, so this reminds me of me and my brother Jay and Jim out here just learning how to throw, learning how to tackle. When he goes on this side, watch this. Outside foot is back. And he's keying to what? Football. All right. Now, let me ask you this. When the quarterback's in the gun, you see this center go like this all the time? What's a tip? Were you looking at the center's head or the quarterback's feet, or what were you doing to get off the ball in a shotgun? He's still watching the ball for me. They can do all that stuff they want. I still got to watch the ball. Exactly. Learning how to be part of the team. And there's no better a place to learn how to play football than the state of Ohio. There's great coaches, a lot of tradition in this state. And last thing, watch this. This is what he was good at. Now. You'd be the right tackle, get in your stance. Okay, we're gonna okay, do some You act like you're past set. Here, okay? He go. acts like he's gonna run fast up. right by you. So you overset. Watch him go inside. Oh, oh, oh. He would smoke you, boy. Okay. Uh, uh, Tell me about Coach Tony Dungy. You guys have a connection, obviously. You came in after Coach Dungy Tampa, took him to a Super Bowl, but he's getting inducted in the Hall of Fame. Tell me about your relationship, and maybe something about Tony that we don't know. Well, Tony and I never really crossed paths that much professionally. Only time we saw each other was when we were on opposite sidelines, and I'm happy he's going to the Hall of Fame. It makes me feel better about losing to him as many times as I did, but class act. Uh, what he did, not only on the field as a coach, but off the field for so many people. Uh, it's a well-deserved honor, and I wish him the very, very best. You know, the good news is someday you're going to be in here, I hope. No, I don't think so. This is uh, for a select group. But I just am so thrilled with the progress they've made here, the $500 million renovation that's going on here. If you're a football fan, put Canton on your bucket list. you got to see this to believe it. Tell me finally about who uh, who you got coming up. You were talking about you doing Brett Favre on your show and your quarterback show, Quarterback Guru. Tell me about that. Well, we've really just done quarterback. We've done young quarterbacks that are coming into the draft, and we decided we would try to do a shot with Brett Favre because he's going into the Hall of Fame, as you know, and I have some history with him his first three years in Green Bay. It's an awesome show. It says a lot about Favre, his durability, his playmaking, and uh, just his charismatic style that he had. It's uh, going to be a cool show. I encourage you to check it out. Awesome. Cool. All right, thanks. Good to see you.